now. Our top story tonight comes out of the Wood Lake neighborhood in Chesterfield, where a man's body is pulled from the Swift Creek Reservoir. Police tell us tonight a pair of teenagers who were fishing made the discovery this afternoon. An emergency crews quickly arrived to bring the body to the medical examiner. A.J. Nwoko has been on scene since the beginning. He joins us live. And A.J., any word yet on the victim's uh, identity? No, from Chesterfield Police, they still haven't identified the victim. However, people who live in the area nearby believe they may know who it is. And I see the fishing boat floating by and I go, oh, that's the first one I've seen in about uh, a week or two. It's a fishing boat that Judy Lorello is likely to remember for a long time, not because of what was caught, but because of what was found, a human body floating in the Swift Creek Reservoir. I'm shocked. I am very shocked. That feeling of shock was felt throughout this quiet waterside community Wednesday afternoon. Chesterfield police arrived at Village Square Place in the Woodlake neighborhood of Chesterfield just after 2 p.m. With the help of Chesterfield Fire and EMS, police were able to pull the body from the water. At this time, Chesterfield police are waiting on the medical examiner to confirm the victim's identity. But residents like Lorello fear she may already know. It's a good kid, nice. Polite, <clears throat> easygoing, happy. Lorello believes the victim is a man who went missing more than a month ago. She says he and his family live here. Shouldn't have happened. I don't know how. It's just sad. It's really sad. Though the body hasn't been identified, flowers could be seen outside the door of a nearby home Wednesday evening. Obviously, my my heart go out to their family. Uh, I, I don't know what happened. I certainly hope there was nothing malicious done, uh, but even if it was just a pure accident, it's just a very sad situation. Now, as police investigate, questions linger for residents who live near this typically bustling area, now tainted with the loss of life. It's just so sad that that joy and excitement is offset by something this tragic. This investigation is still ongoing. Chesterfield Police is asking anyone with information to call Crime Solvers at 804-748-0660. That'll do it for us now live in Chesterfield. AJ Nwoko, NBC 12. Our condolences to his family.